All right, so today I got a package in the mail, and this is the Picker Up truck from the Fallout series, which is really cool. Uh, this is actually not what I thought was gonna be in that box. It actually shocked me when I did that little bit at the beginning of this video and opened it up and seen that it was the Picker Up truck. This is supposed to be something completely different. And that package that I thought it was is actually supposed to come today. But this came Saturday. But I did think it was pretty weird that I did get that package early, but it wasn't what I thought it was. So we got the picker up truck here. Now I did do the Fusion Flea uh, a little while ago when it came out. And I had to get the picker up truck because I thought this was a pretty cool, always thought this was a pretty interesting little ride in Fallout. So we had to get it. And also I've already started, you know, collecting these sons of bitches. So might as well go ahead and get the picker up truck as well. I don't know if you see that, but I got some damage to the box, which sucks. This side you get to pick her up uh, from Christless. You got building a nuclear future together. I like how it always says that little slogan like it's a good thing on every one of these uh, boxes. In appreciation of your contribution to Christless. So there's that. On this side it says, thank you. Your dedication to Christless Motor Company remains invaluable. And I think this is exactly what it says, except for it has picker up in it and stuff like that. This is exactly what it says on the Fusion Flea box. So I'm not gonna go over all this, I'm just gonna show you the box, the pictures. Looks pretty cool. Let's go ahead and get into this box, shall we? So after a few minutes of fighting with this damn box to get it open and not having no successful and satisfying suction release because I'm already pissed off and cussing at everything in the room because it's pissing me off. We finally get into the box. Once inside the box, we get schematics of each side of the vehicle, even the bottom, the undercarriage, you get a schematic of. You get to see what it looks like on the box before you even open it, which is, I thought was a really cool detail. Moving on from the outside of the box, you get a styrofoam box inside to protect the goods. Keeps the little models from having any fatalities during their shipping process. Tape to the styrofoam box, you have the picker up technical guide. Once inside, you have the picker up truck packaged nice and safely so I don't have to worry about any scratches or any damage. Out of the box, the picker up truck looks nice and crisp with the red candy paint job, which is slick. I think this is going to look nice paired with the blue Fusion Flea on my shelf. On both sides, right above the running boards, you have a sticker that says use clean energy. So I guess that's where you put your nuclear materials into the picker up truck. The tailgate has picker up stamped onto it and the tailgate also opens and closes. So that's nice that they added that little bit of detail. The doors do function as well. Quite a bit of detail on the interior of the truck as well. Got all your dials, everything painted up in there. It's got your stitching for the seat. It's got your speakers detailed onto it. You can see door handles. So they didn't skip out. That's, that's why I like the one companies replicas because their quality is top notch. You can also pop the hood on the picker up truck and see the nice power bank that runs the truck. You got your power core that is removable. The wheels up front, you can turn them in any direction you want them. They didn't leave out any detailing on the bottom of the truck. You also got a tab where you can pull to see the light up feature that this truck has. If we pull that tab, you can see the light up feature under the hood. The fusion core lights up. It also has a plunger, so when you close it, close the hood, it turns off, and when you open it, it turns on. That's nice. Now, I do recommend that you do take the batteries out of these things when you're just keeping them on display because the batteries over time will corrode and screw the battery housing up. So, do not let that happen. So, that was the Wan Company picker up truck replica. I really do like the quality of Wan Company's replicas never disappointed me i have their the fusion flea i have the pit boy replica which is my favorite so far but i still do like the car replicas they're really nice also comes with a pen forgot to show you all that but here it is so that's the video guys hope you enjoyed it if you did please leave a like subscribe i have another video coming up sometime this week i'm not 100 percent sure what day but sometime this week there will be another video something i want to touch on real quick i know i've moved i didn't do a video of me moving it's coming soon so yeah i'm sorry i had to do this video beforehand but it just that's how it happened that is it guys i'll see you later peace